everyone, welcome to Surprise Toy Box. So today I went to a community yard sale in my city. I went with my coworker. It started at 10 and went until 2. Um, I didn't grab that much stuff, but there were a lot of sales, but they were uh, pretty spread far apart. So we had to walk quite a bit and it was really hot today. So uh, the first thing I grabbed was this Mega Blocks. Yes, I know I said I hated Mega Blocks, but I like Hello Kitty. So this is a Mega Bloks Hello Kitty set, Splash and Swim Water Park. Um, it was brand new and sealed. It had a $5 label on it, and I got it for 4 So here is the back. I kind of always looked at these when I was in um, Toys R Us, because there was a sale where everything was like half off. Uh, there was a winner sticker at the top of this box for $25. So, you know, $4 is not too bad. There's a... Uh, Hello Kitty, the Hello Kitty figure here, and Dear Daniel here, and then the monkey friend. At the same sale, there was a box of free stuff, so of course I grabbed some things. First was this sealed My Little Box of Gardening, uh, startup gardening kit for kids. It's brand new with a retail price of $20, so I thought, I'm sure there's some kids in my family that would want this, or give it away, whoever. Uh, got a sheet of precious moment stickers it was actually a folder of uh, stickers but I like this one and then these adorable Halloween treat bags these would be good for um, when I make chocolates and stuff for my co-workers usually for Christmas but you know they probably won't mind if uh, I use Halloween bags next I grabbed this Lego Bionicle. Now, I don't like Bionicles, um, but it's sealed, and that's what got me, and um, it was in like a dollar bin, and the lady said I could offer whatever, like 50 cents, so I was like, sure, 50 cents. So, you can't pass up a sealed box. Next, I helped uh, my coworker who just had a baby uh, grab some Sesame Street books. I got uh, eight books for a dollar. And my coworker got a Thomas the Train um, little engine uh, thrown in. So there's this uh, pop-up book, Cookie Monster pop-up book. I might have to read these. Uh, oh, can't really see this. But there's Elmo's Farm Songs, Good Night Sesame Street, Elmo's New School Day, Rock Monsters, Abby's Special Fairy Tale, Murray's Music Book, and music in your neighborhood and now this actually comes I think with a xylophone because there's a lot of music and it tells you where to play or what to press so there's like little music but I thought they were in pretty good condition and uh, she likes Sesame Street I think all right my co-worker left after a couple hours but I kept going and I found this Lego pencil holder from 2012 it had a $3 price tag on it, but I got it for a dollar. So I think it's complete. It has a little Lego logo here, and then the painter minifig with the mug. It's painting um, the holder white here, which is kind of cool. So I'll probably put that on my desk. And one more thing I did grab was this free, yes, Mega Blocks again. So this is Mega Construct. They kind of rebranded for like older kids. And um, this is a Pokemon Charmeleon. Um, I looked in the box and it's actually still sealed, oops, can't see, but there's no instruction booklet, but you can find the instruction booklet online, so I don't know if, my, if I'll build that sometime. It's a very small set. And I almost forgot I actually did pick up something else, and it was a giant zip-up bag of Playmobil stuff, and I actually just gave it a bath because some of it was kind of grimy. Um, I'm not sure if everything here is Playmobil, I already picked out some trash threw it away like this is definitely not Playmobil and I think this seaweed goes with the flounder um, but there were I saw some figures the bag uh, had a seven dollar price tag on it and I got it for five there's actually some Lego pieces in here and there's a Lego friends character right here um, they this person also had a box of education duplo figures and it's just a box of duplo figures uh, for only five dollars and I kind of regretted not picking that up too because I actually never seen it before so yeah that was my last pickup 
So I did have a lot of fun today. Um, this is my second time yard sailing. And um, of course it was much better than the last uh, sail that I went to in the city that's like an hour away from me. Um, I might have to go again. I might be addicted. Uh oh. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought of the stuff that I picked up and leave a thumbs up, a comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!